According to Sacramento County records, the lot line for this parcel 0700260001. The extent of this parcel is approximately 18 to 19 feet from the indicated structure, which would be this tin shed with the fancy aluminum siding where a 2200 degree crematorium would go. This is the pad for a new building. The city of Folsom has no permits. This would be grading where you can see the tracks of the heavy equipment. They've removed all the rocks that were piled here. You can see the, the ruts. And this would be on the opposite side of the lot line, so this would be on public land. And you can see where something very heavy duty tires took all the rocks and filled in that space, which is also public land. Nearly everything abutting and surrounding this uh, Miller Lakeside cemetery operation is bordered by public land. Here's the sole access. Here's the crematoria sites abutting people's burials all around. And here's hard evidence of this open area being created after the removal of the fence, which is in earlier records. And you can see where the public land got all the dumping to create this extra space. The sole access for the 2200 degree furnace and the giant propane tanks with a blast radius of well over 1800 feet, as proven by tests, the sole access is this. By the way, that is Mormon Street you're looking at. Guess they'd need a driveway permit. My main concern is the laws have been flouted and the city of Folsom City Council is pretending that an architectural review committee has the right to grant changes to the open space zoning usages. Only the city council can make, take an action like that under California law. It's time to let the public landowners, most of them the federal government, know about all of this.